Hi, uh, this is a cute little parlor trick I figured I would share with everybody. Um, everybody knows what the sound of a hard drive spinning up is, but there's a different way to listen to it if you have a piece of primitive technology. Now, what I have here is an old Radio Shack Archer branded telephone listener, which is basically a device for almost converting a telephone into a speakerphone. It has a little, it's basically a small amplifier with a little EM pickup coil on it. And what, how you would use this is you would attach the suction cup pickup coil to your telephone handset and it would pick up and amplify what's coming out of the speaker in the telephone handset. Uh, it picks up EM noise, not, not, not sound waves, uh, which makes it cool for spying on electronic devices and what they're doing. So you all know what a hard drive sounds like when it spins up. I've got a 20 gig Mac store here. I'm just going to spin it up. It's not connected to an interface or anything, just power. Well, I thought I was going to spin it up. What did I do to the power supply? Power supply's on. Let's try that again. There we go. Now it's spinning. Not much drama there. Let's spin it down. Turn on the listener. And we'll put it right next to the spindle motor and start it up again so you can hear what happens. That was an annoying noise, wasn't it? Again, one more time. So you can hear the sound of the head seeking as it starts up. And that was it. That <coughs> was the sound of the head moving back and forth as it loaded its firmware from the reserved section of the hard drive. Okay, now this is great when you're actually running on the system. You can actually hear the hard drive moving, the head moving back and forth, and it just sounds like those clicks. What we're going to do now is show you what happens when your hard drive is having a bad day. This here, IBM Death Star, affectionately known as the Death Star series, uh, is not having a good day and its spin-up sound is terrible. Uh, the spin-up seems fine, but it's not able to load its microcode off the drive, so it'll basically, it's a dead drive, it'll never come ready. Okay, so, let's listen to this carefully. Don't want to blow our ears out again. you're hearing there is the hard drive the heads resetting Let's see if we can find the voice coil so that's the heads moving back to the position back to the stops and then trying again and you can also hear the motor Every time it dips a little bit, that's the motor slowing down, resetting, and coming back up to speed, or at least trying to get back up to speed. This drive is not having a good day. I don't know what's wrong with it, but it's probably never going to work again. Fun fact, I believe the first drive was a 5400 RPM drive, which is why it sounded relatively subdued, whereas this one is a 7200 RPM drive, which is why it takes a while to spin up and you get more of a higher frequency once it is spun up. We'll do it one more time just for giggles. Uh, 
I botched that. I didn't have the telephone listener turned on. Okay, one more time, Gisley Goggles. Ready? I think we'll stop torturing that. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, look for these on eBay. They're they're pretty cheap and they're loads of fun.